But I would just kind of parse personal and autobiographical. Yeah. Um, there's a lot of stuff that is deeply important to us and isn't necessarily a photocopy. I tend to give my characters my syllabus and my clothes or my resume and my clothes. Yeah. But just because someone's rocking your resume and they're rocking your outfit, they're not they you. ain't you. Right. And, you know, it's, it's, it's interesting because I've, uh, there's stuff about my life that's so not like my characters. Um, you know, I chip parts of myself to make these characters. Yeah. But there's still, and I'm not just saying that to be cute or to be coy. Um, I, for example, grew up with two absolutely out of control, amazing sisters that are a huge part of my life. Right. And I've never written about them because they've asked me never to write about them. And without my sisters, I don't make any sense. No one can understand me without right. my sisters. So if you're not showing us that, then you're really not showing us you oh, as, no far, as far as these books go. No so question. we shouldn't take any random sister in one of these short stories that is in a collection or published in a magazine or Lola in uh, Oscar Wow, Lola, uh, Oscar's sister. We shouldn't take that to be, this is a stand-in for my sister. Nah, yeah. let me tell you. It's the the simple-minded view of the world. No, no. I just say the day you meet my sisters in literature, you'll know. We will know. Is that right? Yeah. Okay, good. Great. I promise great. you. Great. There will be no doubt.